Hey guys, home free people. So I'm here early for this home free thing. It's sold out like a motherfucker. Good thing I bought my tickets like a month and a half ago. But yeah, I'm early. I'm gonna get something to eat in here and like, I don't know, see how many people are going to this thing. It's near this university thing, the big university near my city. And inside there's this big feeder, which is pretty cool. But yeah, it's a big-ass building. I gotta go that way. But yeah, I'm gonna go get something to eat and enjoy this home free concert. Take it easy. Bye! Check out your boy. There's a uh, got some good seats here. It's supposed to be up there in the balcony area, but them stairs are a motherfucker. As I have them leg problems, so they switched me over to the closest of the stage. And look how close it is. I don't know if you saw that, but people are still being let in. So this could be some good shit. Yeah, let you know after. Take it easy. Bye. <laughs> we are home free, the world's first all vocal country man. And we're so excited to all here with us this evening. Now let's get one thing straight. This is not just a concert. This is a party. Everyone here is involved in the party. So if the song gets a hold of you, stand on up, shake your butt a little bit. But most importantly, we want every single person in here singing along with us. Y'all ready to do some singing, Edmonton? <laughs> well, that's a whole bunch of y'all first timers tonight, so I reckon we ought to get to know each other a little bit. Now, um, Rob has a drinking problem. <laughs> <laughs> uh, I mentioned earlier that we're an all vocal band, and I mean that. Everything you've heard up to this point, everything you're going to hear. This evening is vocally produced, including all those drum sounds coming out of the back. Yeah. Yeah. Now we are going to have to discuss uh, one thing, and that is your 
Ah, <laughs> <laughs> oh, it's all right. It's not that cold. Thank you for clearing that up. Uh, okay, listen. Myself, Austin, and Chance here are from the deep south of the United States. <laughs> Where we don't have to rate our winter weather by how much worse it could be. <laughs> it, it don't snow. Not even a little bit. What we experienced walking just from the bus. <laughs> oh, yeah. Is what's known as a state of emergency. <laughs> And a real one, too. I'm not talking about one of these Donald Trump fake emergencies. What? Thanks again. <laughs> All right, I'll get some good photos of us so far. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know if it's possible to get the house lights up, but I'm sure we'd like to get a look at these crazies. <laughs> <laughs> well, that's right. We're in Alberta. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good, I gotta give it to you. <laughs> Some of y'all seem to be trying desperately to capture that perfect photo. Yeah. I guess you haven't accomplished that yet. <laughs> or maybe you're just stringing the show to your cheap friends. <laughs> <laughs> well, we hate to disappoint anybody, so why don't we take a couple moments so that everyone in here can get that one perfect photo. Go ahead, get those devices out, everyone. Five, six, seven, eight. Baby. 
And it turns out I'm at my best when I just say what comes to mind. Because one night I was focused a little too hard as I was attempting to describe Rob and perhaps the two most appropriate adjectives, lovable and huggable. <laughs> But I said rubbable. <laughs> <laughs> now, we had experienced a series of surreal moments not long ago because we spent multiple nights on the Grand Ole Opry in Nashville. <laughs> you are hardcore country music fans and you know that is sacred ground right there. And, uh, it's surreal every time, no matter how many times you've done it. And we've been fortunate enough to do it a handful of times now. But the most recent evening we were there, we got to share the stage with Josh Turner and Little Big Town. That's our reaction. In private. Now we hit another mile recently that we never even dreamt to be within the realm of possibility. Our YouTube channel has passed a quarter of a billion views. Damn! So again, thank you all for that. And please continue to watch and share those videos. It really goes a long way. Uh, but when we did the Opry this, this most recent time, we had just passed 254 million views to be exact. And so we're stoked about that. And uh, Josh actually stuck around after his second set to watch us perform. And little Big Town wished us luck before we went on and told us they'd be watching. So we're all excited, ready to take the stage, and hoping to impress our country peers. And the announcer of the Grand Ole Opry says, This next group is country music's only all vocal band. There's a smattering of applause. He says all four of their albums have debuted at the top of the billboard charts. Some more applause, some moves and ahs. And then he says, they have amassed more than 254 views on YouTube. <laughs> I'll keep you humble right there. Well, you ready for some more music? I got rice cooking in the microwave. Got a three-day beard that don't plan to shave. And it's a goofy thing, but I just gotta say, hey, I'm doing all right. Yeah, I might go make me some homemade soup. So, the whole free country just ended. Well, I left because like, I think I'm pretty sure they'd made an encore because downstairs I heard more music playing because they said they were leaving and I got out because I had to uh, go to the washroom and beat the traffic. And I'm downstairs and all of a sudden I hear I'm still singing. I go, so, do they do encores after they say they're leaving? Oh well, <laughs> good to know for next time. So anyway, this concert was great. It was amazing. It's like watching him live. It's a whole different thing. Tim, I'm surprised that voice comes out of him. That deep bass. It's like, holy crap. And Rob, I'm so surprised that 
that voice comes out of that dude. <laughs> Everybody in like Austin, Tim, Chance, and Adam, they're all great. Especially the beatboxer. Beatboxer. Oh God, I need, who was it again? I am so bad at remembering names. I gotta eventually, hold on, give me one sec. Adam. I think it's Adam, the beatboxer. He was freaking amazing. Cause Chance was there. Tim. Yeah, Adam, he's the beatboxer. Yeah, he was flat out great. If you've seen, like, I'm gonna put the video in here and you'll see it beforehand. But yeah, like uh, Tim making jokes about the weather, like, He's not used to sweater. I'm used to it. Look at this. Not bad. We're used to this shit. Where we can like open jacket in a toque only. Yeah, but they're from Alabama and shit. Somewhere in the south. But yeah, great concert. Man, they're off the calorie now to do their thing, but shit, that was a great ass concert. I enjoyed myself. Greatest I, I'm so glad. I got to know who these guys are. I was like, the, the adventure begins. Like, holy shit. Man, I'm surprised they didn't sing 9 to 5. That was my favorite song. Yeah, but like I said, it was great. Anyways, take it easy, guys. Bye.